Hi guys, so I'm preparing a video to show you my transit, or it's already prepared, but I just, and I will upload it um, either before or after this video, I'm really not sure, but I just wanted to share with you a thought that came to my mind while traveling. Now, I'm, I just literally came into the room and I'm just trying to get comfortable I'm not trying to look perfect or anything. I'm just trying to share a moment with you, all right? So, yeah, I'm sitting down. Um, that's my little snack I'm about to eat. That's the welcome snack that they prepared. But on my way here, a friend of mine mentioned that I should do more videos showing my trips, my travel, and the things that I'm doing. And although... I really want to sometimes I'm just deterred and I'm deterred it's one thing to pull out the camera showing your you know moving around with people some people don't want to be on camera and some people don't want to be on camera and I do have to take that into consideration but also there's sometimes you post videos of the things that you're doing and people are not welcoming to it instead of they appreciating the videos or congratulating you or you know liking your success they believe that you're flaunting your success and let me tell you guys over the years I have learned to be humble what I mean is not everything I'll share with you. And even if you feel like you're close to me and you're my friend and no disrespect to anyone, but it's not every single thing that, it's not every single thing I will share. And the reason being over the years, I've met people who just, they, it's either, oh, so she has money, so let me ask her, to lend me money and if I say no then we become enemies or if I would lose friends because they believe oh you know I am um, you know I'm not being humble if I show certain things and show you you know the my life or what the things that I'm doing and especially my trips the travels and the people that I meet and some of the people that I meet they don't want to be on camera no matter who they are you know and I've been fortunate to meet some um, very uh, progressive individuals I'm not going to use the word rich because I've met rich poor whatever um, but very progressive individuals and one thing I've learned is to remain humble because today you might be up, tomorrow you'll be down. You never know what life has in store. You understand, you may be watching someone's uh, video and they're doing, they're showing you their hotel room and they're speaking at a conference, but you really don't know the struggles behind it. Let me tell you, there are a lot of entrepreneurs out there and they, sometimes they have money and sometimes they don't and that's just life right so I remember this guy and I'm gonna call him nobody all right so nobody I met him actually this year in Bahrain and uh, yes this one of the places that I've been to and I've traveled to and he I basically visit him and it had his home and he showed me his place now the entire thing I'm supposed to be impressed but I wasn't it's not like I'm impressed or not it's just like what's the reasoning or the purpose behind you showing me all your shoes in the closet that you have um, and all your clothing what is the purpose and the reason why I say this, I expect that maybe from a 20 year old, but not from a grown individual. And 
but I smiled and I go, oh yeah, you know, and I notice every time, you know, that person, nobody will come around there and look at, you know, the shoes that I have on my feet or the jewelry that I wear. I'm not going to put everything out there that I have for what, but that's just me. I remain humble, right? Because again, I've met people at their peak of success and they have dropped down and they've come back up because that, that is life. Yeah, so showing me all the stuff that you have and showing me a place that you're not paying for, the government is paying for, doesn't impress me. And I say, humble, humility, just take it all in and do what you have to do and that's the reason that's my philosophy and you know that's the reason I don't really show every single thing and you know there are people like okay um, we don't know your movements because at times I'm just simply scared afraid afraid of what you might say what you might think and yeah not the you know it's not everything is not a bed of roses and I'm going to leave with this information for you. Some of the happiest individuals that I've met were not rich in wealth, but rich in their heart, rich with how they treated people, rich with kindness, rich with love. And their humility, their humbleness just taught me there's no reason to over exalt and, you know, just appreciate life for what it is. And some individuals that I've met, no matter how much money they actually had, you will not see it. All right, guys, so I'm going to be showing you some more videos and, you know, letting you see what I'm doing and, you know, the trips that I'm making. And I, the reason I am showing it is to motivate and inspire you not to create animosity towards me or hatred towards me. All right. So you're gonna see my trips you're gonna see my travels and yeah anything you want me to put out there or any information that you need all right and around my travels around the things that i'm doing yeah hit me up in the comment section all right until next time guys please share this video and please like please comment bye bye